Thousands of riders from across the world came to Tulsa to compete in the Pinto World Championships. Tears reporter Jamil Donath caught up with one rider who has a story of both passion and perseverance. Whoa. Linda Lewis and her horse Stella are prepping for their next competition. Floridian rider is one of thousands who have trotted to Tulsa for the Pinto World Championships. And at the age of 66, she's also the second oldest rider here. As long as my health lets me, I think I'll keep doing it for a long time. Linda didn't get her first horse until she was 35. My husband bought me my first horse as a surprise for our 10th anniversary. And with 30 years of showing under her belt, she's had her fair share of relationships, as many as eight horses. They might get, be getting up in years. It just might be getting to be kind of like a bad marriage and you need a divorce. Linda says she's not as sharp as she once was, but her age is not her only battle. In 2010, I found out that I had ovarian cancer. After intense chemotherapy, she beat cancer and immediately got back on the saddle. Then it came back twice. I finished 25 rounds of radiation in five weeks of low-dose chemotherapy. But this time, she's not letting cancer keep her from the arena. That just made me so happy that I could make it. Because twice before, cancer has gotten in my way. In fact, the cancer survivor says she owes her life to her hobby and horses. You have to have something you, you want to live for. A passion for life and pintos. Jamil Donath, 2 News works for you. And a big congratulations to Lyndon tonight who took first and second in her events today.